Hi everyone! So unfortunately Christmas has come and it is gone and now we have to wait a whole other year for it to be Christmas again but I had the best day yesterday. It was so nice and relaxed and I got some really really nice things and I was some things that I was surprised by as well and it was just a really nice day. So today I'm going to show you what I got for Christmas. I just want to quickly say I'm not doing this video to brag in any way, I just like watching them so I thought I would do one myself. I know I'm very lucky and this year in particular we, like my, me and my family, we have gone all out for each other and I've got so many things and I've, I just feel so blessed to have them all so yeah, no way to brag, I just want to show you all. So I'm just going to start with what my mum got me. So the first thing I'm going to show you is this pouch from Anthropology, and it's got my initials sewn into it. I think it's just the cutest little pouch ever. I've been wanting one of these for ages, so oh, I, I'm just in love with it. I was going to put makeup on it, but if anything, I think it might be a bit too nice for makeup, but we will see what happens. As I said a million times now, I'm really into baths at the moment, so I asked for a lot of bath stuff for Christmas, and one of the things I got was the Aromatherapy Associates Relax candle. Now this one smells really nice, but what I really like about it is the packaging, well the outside anyway. It's got the little symbol of Rome Therapy Associates on it. It's just really nice and simple. I really like that. Now, one little thing that I really wasn't expecting was from Lush. I've never really tried Lush things before, but I've always wanted to, especially recently. So I was really happy when I opened up this box and it has lots of Lush bath bombs and soaps in it. It's just a really, really nice thing. Like I think I've got this, which is the snowman fun. So you build a snowman with it, it's like Play-Doh, so that'll be really good. I got the melting snowman, which has actually fallen apart inside the bag. And a few other things there. I got the cinnamon holly one. I'm not just I'm not sure the name because I've ripped it off, but it makes the bath green, it's got glitter on it, it's really nice and it makes bubbles in the bath, which again is really nice. And I was so happy to get this. So one thing that's become a bit of a tradition for a mum to get me each year is the Philosophy Shower Gels. I normally get two a year and this year I got Snow Angel and Raspberry Glazed. Now Raspberry Glazed is my favourite, it smells a bit like a Christmas cookie which is always a nice smell to have in the bath with you or in the shower with you and I'm really looking forward to using these properly. Now I tend to go through some phases of crafty things like for a while I was doing knitting and cross stitch which might sound a little bit sad to some people but I like it and I decided this year that I wanted to do colouring which is a bit childish I must admit but I just wanted something that I could sit with and just zone out a little bit so I got this peppy Angie's Patterns Volumes 1 and 2 and it's just a little colour colouring book with some designs in it. They're quite hard, they're really small and I also got some pens to do those with. DVD box sets is always a big one I ask for each year. So this year I got five and they are Supernatural which I'm obsessed with. This is season nine, I've watched all the seasons and if you haven't seen them already I would totally recommend them. I've heard a lot about suits this year. My sister's boyfriend in particular is always talking about it, so I thought I would give that one a try. A really popular one right now, I think, is American Horror Story. I've seen the series and really enjoyed it, and I've seen all the other series and really enjoyed them too, so that's another one. And the final two I have are Two Broke Girls, which is hilarious, and Orange is the New Black Season 1, which I have seen, and oh, it was just amazing. I'm so excited for Season 3 to come. Now some beauty bits for my mum, I got the Bobbi Brown Mini Eye and Lip Palette, if you can see that there, it's such cute packaging, I am just in love with this and it's this tortoiseshell and inside there is two lipsticks, a lip gloss and, oh, and two eyeshadows and I just think it is the cutest, oh three eyeshadows, I think it's just the cutest little mini little palette I've ever seen so I'm just in love with this I can carry my handbag it's just perfect. Now as you can see this is something from Burberry and I have seen the sheer barley eyeshadow all over the place recently so I was really really hoping I'd get this for Christmas and I did it comes in this really cute packaging and just take it out there I just oh, I think this is just so luxurious it's so 
pretty and sleek and it just, oh, I think it's just worth the money in the packaging alone. It's this really nice like bronzy colour and it transfers really well onto the lids and I've just been looking forward to it for ages. I'm so excited that I got this one. Now I really like things that help me sleep and this year I got the This Works Deep Sleep Plus Pillow Spray. Along with that I got the Aromatherapy Associates Instant Inner Strength. Now this is a roller ball. You just roll it on the back of your wrist before you go to sleep and it's supposed to just calm you and send you off to sleep. The one downfall I've found with this so far is that it's really hard to get out of this packaging. Now, a few final things I got for my mum was pyjamas. This is something that I get every year. I don't really buy pyjamas myself. I just use them all through the year, the ones I get each Christmas. So yeah, this year I got this jumper here. It says meow 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 and it's got some cat whiskers on it. I had this one on my wish list, I think it was two weeks ago. So I was so happy to get this. And along with that, actually, I got these from Primark. They have little, I don't know if you can see clearly, but you, they have little cat faces on them and they have cuffs at the bottom and they're just so nice. I'm so excited to wear these. They'll last me all year. I just, I love them. And finally, to go along with that, keeping with the cat theme, I have some slippers here from Next and they have cat faces on them and what I really think is special about these is that on the bottoms it says today I chose to hibernate and I think that is just really cute. Now I'm moving on to my sister and I'm going to start with more pyjamas because I love pyjamas and I, they're just one of my favourite things to get at Christmas time. So she got me a few different ones and the first one is a nighty, and it says I'd rather stay in bed and it's a nighty dress but it's like a jersey material which is going to be so warm for winter and I just I love it it's so nice. Now you'd think that they thought I liked cats or something because I have another nighty here and it has a big cat on it and it says what are you looking at and I think it's just really cute and I can't wait to wear that as well and finally I got some big fluffy slipper socks from Dorothy Perkins and oh these are so cozy I cannot wait to get these on my feet. Now another thing my sister got me this year was pants from Topshop. Now I got her a couple of pairs of these last year so I don't know if she's just got me them because I got her them then or what but they are really nice ones she's got me. So the first pair are the Little Mermaid. I think these are so sweet and then she got me Minnie Mouse and finally again if you cannot tell there's a theme here hats. <laughs> and these ones I think are just hilarious. They say perfect on them and it's a cat in a pink wig. I think they're so adorable. Now for one of my favourite gifts I got this year and it is the Babyliss Big Hair and mine is a pink one which is 42 millimeter barrel. Now I don't normally wear my hair down in videos or on blog posts or anything because my hair is quite hard to manage. It's quite thick and frizzy and I've just never found anything to work with it. These things are amazing i've used them twice now and they just glide through your hair and look this is my hair after using them and it feels like i just came out of the salon these are amazing things now my sister also surprised me she got me a joe malone perfume and the one she chose was the nutmeg and ginger cologne now this is never one that i would have chosen for myself but i am so glad she got me it it smells so fresh and clean but with a bit of a kick with the ginger, it's just amazing perfume. Now finally, the big gift from my sister was tickets to see S Club 7 in Glasgow and I'm so excited for a bit of nostalgia. I loved S Club 7 when I was young, so we will be going to Glasgow and as a little bit of an extra to that gift, she got me these vouchers. And with them, I get, well we both get complimentary drinks, we get our, a massage in our head, we get cut blow dry and styling of our hair, makeup applied and we get a professional photo shoot so that is going to be really really fun. One final thing that I forgot for my sister was this little Disney decoration. She got each of us one of these and the one she got me was the mice from Cinderella in the glass slipper and I think this is just such a sweet little gift. It's just one of those things that you can keep forever and I just love presents like this. Another gift I got this year was the Shu Umera Umura eyelash curlers again on my wish list I'm so happy to get these. Moving on to friends and for my friend Will I got an Olivia Burton watch. This one that I got is actually the wrong one. He got it gift wrapped and didn't realise that they got the wrong one. This one's white and the one that it should be is the brown one with the rose gold face. So he's going to return it and get that one. 
because it should have been that one and that is the one I was really wanting so I'm so excited to get it. A bit of an unexpected gift from him was this Swarovski earrings. I've been wanting them for ages and I just think they're so, so pretty. They're little dangly ones and they're just, although I probably wouldn't get a lot of wear out of them because I don't go out often, for like special occasions these are just beautiful and I just, I'm in love with them. From my friend Tanya I got a really cute sewing kit and it's by Sewing Days and there's some ribbons, some buttons and some thread and a cute little pair of scissors to go with it and I think that's just a really nice keepsake gift. They're just so sweet and I love them. From my friend Sean I got a voucher for the spa in Aberdeen. It's a 50 pound voucher and I will definitely be going to get a massage of this I'm desperate for. Uh, Indian head massage, I cannot wait. From a family friend, Penny, we got, we each got a decoration. It says, Merry Christmas, Laura, and then it says, All my love from Penny Richard, which is who it's from, and I think that is just the most adorable gift ever. It's, again, it's one of those things you can keep forever, and it's just a really, really thoughtful idea. Along with that from her, I got a Joe Malone voucher, and this is one of three. I got one for my sister's boyfriend also, and one for my mum. Also from my sister, which I forgot, which I have no idea how I managed to forget, is Dumbo. Again, this is a gift she got for each of us. We all got these big Disney teddies and I got Dumbo and I'm so happy I did. He's so big and cute and oh, I'm so happy I got him. But by no means least is the needed, I'm gonna say needed, chocolate. I got so much chocolate this year. I got coins, I got a snowman. I got some chocolate block gingerbread, melts from Hotel Chocolate, and oop, that's it falling down on the floor. And finally, these Gillian chocolates. It's a huge box, and I cannot wait to go and stuff my face with these. So, that is what I got for my Christmas this year. As I said, I know I am very lucky and I've been very, very spoiled this year. I'm so happy with everything I got, so thank you to everyone who gave me. I had the best day ever. I would love to hear about what you got for Christmas, so you comment below with what you got. And please like and subscribe to this video, and thank you for watching, so bye!